Hey friends, uh, I just wanted to talk about something really funny that just happened. Um, so for about a month now, my um, my fan for my all my heating and cooling controls just wouldn't work. Um, before that, it was it would only work on high, um, but more recently, which actually alluded to it being the motor ro mo sorry the motor blower resistor which is a little pack um that just connects close to the blower motor and it provides uh three different resistance levels uh to have your low medium high um speeds for your fan well so i get the resistor I install it and nothing happens. I noticed when I was installing it that the little, the, um, the connector, the connector doodle, uh, was a little bit corroded. So I was like, all right, maybe it's not getting great, um, great connection. So I clipped off all the ends and did my own, uh, own ends with just your standard spade connectors. Um, still nothing. And then I'm like looking, I'm reading through the EVTM, uh, this way. Electrical vacuum, electrical and vacuum troubleshooting manual. It has literally all of these circuits in this entire thing. I thought it was a fuse maybe. And then finally, like I check the wires coming out and like there's like a splice in there like it's like the motor itself has been replaced and it looked like it has seen some age so I my final act was to just you know put new splices in there and two wires just the motor did that still nothing I end up just leaving it on turning the motor on high and then going out and whacking the motor. <laughs> You've got to be fucking kidding me. I'm pretty sure that probably would have done that without all my bullshit that I did before. Um, so the motor itself is bad. Um, luckily, I have one of the awesome Aero Stars that has a whole nother assembly back here for heating and cooling, which I don't actually use, um, since it needs to have the vehicle running for it to be used. It, it makes more sense in a passenger vehicle than a, a van in which I live. Plus, I took out all of the, um, the ductwork when I took off all the panels. So I'm going to see if that blower motor will will be able to replace the one that is uh now fucked up. Yeah, I turned it I turned it down and turned it back up. It won't it won't kick on. It's either dirty in there or um the motor itself is starting to fail. Um but yeah. So we'll see. This motor actually works really well. Uh the last time I checked it was is in pretty good shape and I don't know if they're interchangeable or not, but we'll see. And that's a project to put on the list for next week. Um, so yeah, adventures in repairing vans while living in one. So yeah, god damn it. Should have tried the Russian method from the beginning. Always remember to hit it first and see if something's something shakes loose. Other than that, I'm done for now. Have an excellent week and a lovely long weekend. Um, I'm Chloe Madison, if you didn't already know. Uh, Clomads on Instagram and Twitter and the Facebooks and the YouTubes and... Click the bell! Click the like button, subscribe, and click the bell, and like, and comment down below, and... Bye!